How to create a mobile friendly Canva website. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how easy and simple it is to add or uh, create the, let's say here, the optimization for the mobile version of the Canva website. The process is very easy. So we are going basically here to head over canva.com, sign in for an account and get the access to our workspace of Canva. Then we are going to create a standard uh, website that we are going to have here. So we are going to type in on the search bar website only. And then we are going to see the different types of website. So you can go ahead and create one from the presets or the templates that we have already, or you can create from scratch in here. So I'm going to speed up here the process uh, by getting a uh, preset website. So for example, I'm going to choose a free one like this, and then we're going to click on customize this template. Now, how we can make this website uh, compatible or mobile friendly. So as you can see here on uh, the Canva editor, we can go ahead and preview the uh, website. So how we can make it or see it as a uh, mobile friendly website. Here we have everything fine. Everything is okay, is cool on the desktop version. We're going to click on preview. And from here, we are going to see the preview of that website. It will pop up here a window that will show us the website on the desktop and also on the mobile version. So we are going to wait for that preview to appear. And then we are going to judge if there is an element that will be here on the way of the uh, mobile friendly, uh, as you can see, and etc. Here we have the, as you can see, uh, the uh, desktop version. So we are going to uh, make that assured that it is going to be resizing on mobile. So we are going to see the mobile and see that this is the first thing or the first section is good. The second section is going to be uh, not that good if we are going to resize for the mobile version. And the third or the other sections are going to be okay. So we have only a problem with the this one or the uh, second section, which is going to be here, the French filling. So we are going to close that and we are going to make sure that we are going to put this image, for example, just like that. I'm going to make it here as small as I can. So we're going to put it in this case. So I'm going to put it here just like that, make it a little bit smaller and we are going to put it in here. So we are going to try and see if it is going to be okay to have it as like that. So I'm going to put it like this. Then we are going to click on preview. And then we are going to see the difference and also the result. So we are going to see that this is better. So we are going to see here the two images has took a position or a well position into this. So we are going only to uh, set up here the button, which is going to be uh, uh, centered just like that. And it is here on the right place. So basically, you are going to see the different uh, images and make, make them a little bit smaller or bigger, depending on the placing that you are going to see in your phone. For example, here we are going to have some, uh, as you can see, little here, uh, let's say uh, maybe a empty space. So we can go ahead and uh, put it in here or make that a little bit smaller. So this one, uh, this section also, we can go ahead and make it a little bit smaller. So just like that, I'm going to make this a little bit smaller just as well. So we are going to put this in here. So I'm going to put everything in order. So we are not going to waste some of the spaces that we need just like that. And you're going to see here a big difference. So we are going to see that the, uh, the nonsense spaces or the empty spaces are gone, just like that. Basically, that was all for today's video. Do not forget to publish your website, and this is it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content, and I hope to see you soon on the next one.